Osmond, everybody. Here we go. Are you all right? Good, yeah, doing well. You look. Yeah. I like your wine. Thank suit. you. It's thank you. Very, it's, very this pleasant. Is the promoting a comedy tie, I guess. Is, is that? It, it, it looks like a, it's Michael Sheen's yeah. in it. That's. Yeah. Uh, oh my goodness. Yeah. Yes. Yes. He's Welsh, you know. He is. Mm. You That's didn't right. know when you worked with him? No, I, I was answering in the affirmative. Oh, yeah. I see. I thought you were like, <laughs> he is well? She yeah. never told me that. Uh, how are you doing? Are you, do you have a nice time on it? Yes. I mean, the cast is extraordinary. We have Tim Robbins, Kristen Wiig, Will Ferrell, Tobey Maguire. Holy crackers. How did you get all those I, people? I, I couldn't believe the first email I got about the project. And everybody just had a lot of fun on it. It's a, it's a relentlessly strange story and world that we're in. And everybody just sort of jumped right in. Did you get nominated for a Grammy for it yet? No. I mean, I hope, hopefully there's... A <laughs> I am, well, I'm I am, sure it's very good. You're, you're two for three uh, tonight. <laughs> no, that, yeah. that that's great. So, yeah. but no Grammy nomination. No Grammy. You know, if they do a spoken word or you know, uh, you know, children's no. book. No, version. no, no, no. <laughs> I don't. I, when they do do, but I don't think they do it for TV shows. It's an Emmy you'll need no. to get for that. Yeah, I guess. You know, so. you did a film uh, years ago with a friend of mine, Olivia Williams. Oh, that's correct. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Makes sense. Yeah, yeah the, that's the one where you saw dead people. Did you ever give it fed up? Do people come up to you and still say that a little bit? No, not so much anymore. And and at the time, it was when we made that film. It, it's still amazing to me that nobody pointed to that line and said, "This is sort of going to be the tagline for the film." It just you didn't know that when you were right making by it. No, well, you were like. Ten or something. True. Yes, right. Yeah. That's, that's right. Was it, were you ten? Ten years old. Yeah. Oh man. Yeah. <laughs> really? That's right. Jeez. Yeah. Uh. <laughs> but I. The thing that. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm so old, man. You should have seen me this morning in my green underpants. It was no good. It's the new year. You yeah. Know. You, you <laughs> Thanks, to, man. You Thank you very much indeed. You what a very pleasant young man you are. Yeah. <laughs> Do you think it has an effect on you in later life? Do you think it's a detrimental effect to be such a big star at such an early age? It can be, um, but honestly, I, I just got really lucky in the sort of projects that I did. My parents were really, you know, kept my feet on the ground. I went to regular school all the way through college. Oh, you didn't have the onset? Uh, no, I mean, that's a, that's, and, and you know, I, I have so much respect for them because it's a tough thing to be on set as the, you know, the parents of the... Uh, uh, of the young actor, but they, you know, most important thing was school and, and staying, you know. That's pretty good, though. I mean, because every thing. time I see a, ch a child actor, I think, 10 years to rehab. <laughs> yeah. Right. Yeah. Oh, yeah, like I'm wrong? <laughs> <laughs> like somebody yeah. just owed me there, like, what a controversial, erroneous statement to make, Craig. <laughs> But that's the thing is that it's sort of the offset stuff that is the biggest hazard, I think. Yeah, I think Because so. on set, like, I mean, film sets in Hollywood were some of the most wholesome environments of, uh, you know, my, my youth, I guess. You know, they're very strict laws for, for kids going to school when they're on projects. Yeah, well, that's true. I, and yeah. actually, I have to say that anything that I've worked on except this show has been very professional. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I mean, here, not so much, but, uh, but, but you know, they, they kind of run things, and they're very strict laws about how long a child can work. Did you have a twin? No. Uh, when you're with, with babies and, like, infants and stuff, they always get, like, twins, triplets, quadruples. Couldn't you use one of the Olsen twins or something? Just, At like... a certain age, you know, we probably intersected yeah. at some point. Yeah. Yeah. But... Well, um... <laughs> Sometimes I feel the audience is ahead of me. Do you ever feel that? Sometimes. Sometimes, yeah. 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 Oh. The horse is always ahead of you over there. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Do you have a horse? I do not have a horse. Really? Why not? No, no room anymore, you know? Well, where'd you live? Uh, Los Angeles and New York part of the time. So Wait, two towns? There's enough room there for a small horse, surely? You know? <laughs> what about in Los Angeles? You must have a little yard. Do you have a little yard area? A tiny yard, yeah. yeah maybe a small horse. Yeah, you yeah, know, small horse. The... What about uh, little uh, herbs? You little, little herbs in your garden there? No, no. A little marijuana plants in your garden? <laughs> Maybe, maybe everyone will follow Colorado's lead soon, but not, not at this point. Oh, I don't know. Well, are you an advocate of the, uh, the sacred Pol earth? Politically, yeah, I think. You know, politically? It's complicated, but yeah, I would think so, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> One person no, yeah I think what's interesting is, I, I think the audience is so sufficiently terrorized that they don't know if it's okay to express <laughs> the Right, opinion. right, yeah. So it's like, <laughs> <laughs> I agree with him, but I'm yeah. scared! <laughs> You're entitled to your opinion. It's America. Absolutely. God bless you, I say. Thank you. Um, I don't do marijuana anymore. <laughs> Pfft, 
too old. How can you do a show like that? It never, I never actually really enjoyed it, to be honest. I think from, it just used to induce panic attacks in me. Yeah. And as you can see, I'm a pretty you know, laid-back person, so... Exactly. You know, I was like, oh! <laughs> Well, listen, good luck with the show. Thank you very much. Um, and, um, yeah. <laughs> maybe, maybe a Grammy nomination next year. I hope so. All right. Hilly Joel, everybody.